<coughs> in this section we will learn how can we read the file okay <laughs> using our low level programming right click come here and uh, write open create and replace file okay then right click come here take a close file right click come here and take a read file a read file now make a connection like this clear after that right click come here take a file path and place here using this file path we can we can uh, read any file we can read any file here i am going to create con constant sorry here i am going to create a constant constant and going to keep it open I'm going to keep it open. All right. Now, right click, take a string indicator. Now, let's go to the previous file. Suppose here I am going to the my computer, and in day twenty one, we had created one. Folder in day 21 we had created one folder, okay, and that folder inside the folder I had uh, saved the sign data, sign data. Take the sign data folder and place here and run the program. Now you can see all the data what okay what okay all the data which I have saved inside the file I am getting, okay. In this way you can read the in this way you can read any text file. Suppose Let's go here and uh, in day one inside this sorry inside this okay inside this inside this in the case that file is available let's try to run. I am getting the same data here. Okay, why? Because here I am able to read the data. Whatever the data I have saved, I have I am able to read. Let's see. Uh, am I able to read another full file or not from my this PC? So let's come into document. And uh, okay, uh, I cannot. Okay, let's see. There is any file, single file is available here. <laughs> okay, let's see. Open this one. Yeah, you can see here we are easily able to extract any of the file, right? Any of the file we are easily able to uh, read here. Now, using this, I can count how many I can count how many elements are present on this file. right I can take a functions and I can break down anything let's suppose take a search okay a search search functions match patterns match patterns okay take this match patterns make a connection like this make a connection create con control create control then create constant zero 
okay and location run the program suppose i want to measure an i and i i want to measure an i now here i am going to measure the ni but before that here i have to do something i have to change something and what i have to change i have to convert it into the upper case everything i want to i have to convert into the upper case or lower case all right now i will select ni so where it is present so first ni is present in this location i think or this one unit okay can i write small ni no so capital ni is present right now here in this unit right again if i will run okay run second ni is present here in this location if i will run so now ni is not available let's see you will not get any ni after this suppose here if i will write ni so that will not take why because ni is not written inside my this folder so now you will able to understand how easily we can extract any file okay and we can use in our system